We're following several developments tonight in a major shakeup for New Jersey politics. One of the state's most powerful lawmakers has now officially conceded. Steve Sweeney, who served as Senate president for the last 11 years, lost to a political newcomer, Edward Durr. But shortly after his win, Durr faced a wave of criticism over racist and xenophobic comments he made on Twitter. NBC 10's Matt DeLucia joins us now from Sewell in South Jersey, where Durr is meeting with local Muslim leaders about those comments made on Twitter. Matt? Right, Tracy, the state senator-elect walked inside this Islamic education center a little after 4 o'clock. Now, this is a closed meeting, but the folks tell me that uh, they plan to talk and pray. Now, this meeting was requested by the New Jersey Council on American-Islamic Relations after a tweet from two years ago surfaced uh, from Edward Durr in which uh, the state senator-elect made Islamophobic remarks. Well, earlier today, Durr spoke with reporters saying he apologized and will represent everyone in the 3rd District. You get behind the keyboard, you don't see a person, and you don't consider the other person. I, I, I just wrote something that I don't mean to offend anybody, and, that, and I'm moving it forward. I'm not going to let the media make it about a post. It is about the policies that have been driven down our throats. Durr said the controversy over the social media post has been hard on his wife. He also says that he is meeting with the group because it is important to respect one another. Islamic leaders say that they felt it was best to engage in conversation rather than leave this issue unchecked. Live in Sewell tonight, I'm Matt Delusha, NBC 10 News.